What's going on, everybody? This is Travis from Candid at the Movies, and today I will be giving you a review of the brand new Hulu release film, Fire Island. Now, Fire Island stars Joel Kim Booster, Margaret Cho, and Bowen Yang. Now, this may this movie is basically about a group of queer queer friends that are out to celebrate their one week of having fun on a little vacation together on Fire Island. And basically, some things happen, and you see all the crazy, crazy antics that happen within the movie. Now, I will go ahead and say, I find this movie very good. It was beyond hilarious, especially being a being a heterosexual individual. I'm not really out there knowing too much about the gay life, so... The handful of friends that I do know that are in, shout out to y'all. I love y'all and respect y'all, but, you know, I don't know too much. So, this is a little cool little introduction for it for me. Thought it was pretty cool. The dynamics throughout the movie, especially with people that are feeling certain type of ways about how other queers portray themselves, was actually a really good, interesting take to see. Some people that are very effeminate. And others that are just to themselves. It was a cool aspect and cool dynamic to see how they interact with one another. How different personalities feel certain different ways. Even how the racial aspects go different ways. I thought that was really cool to see. I thought Margaret Cho added good... um, She added good comedy comedy to the movie. Because she's always been a great comedic person. But... You know, she doesn't get her due like that. And I feel like this movie really gave her some due. She gave gave her some proper respect. And I loved her character. I also loved all of the different storylines that you got throughout. Especially with one character. Basically, wanting their friend to get out there, let loose, and have fun. But the friend is real reserved. And you see that in a lot of movies. But more than anything, it was just a good refreshing thing to see. Especially... Especially for gay people. I actually liked it. Um, I thought the acting was really good. It was shot in a beautiful place. It, like Everything was respectfully done throughout the movie. And fault was... I actually wanted to watch it a little bit more. Like It's only maybe like an hour and 50 minutes. You can get in, get out, and watch it. But I was fairly entertained throughout the whole thing. Hulu did a good job with this one, picking it up. I feel like more people should give it, give it some more looks at it. Like, it's... It's really good. I respect it because it came out a good time for Pride Month, which, happy Pride Month to you and all. By all means, I just think this movie, by all means, deserves a watch. Anyone should check it out. Whether you're gay, straight, or whatnot, this is this is actually a good film. It's going to make you feel things more so about how you would feel if you were in that situation. You're wanting the best for one of your friends but you're having to look out for yourself. And more than anything, it just puts, it puts you in a place where you have to question, do you want, what is what you want good for your friend or does your friend just need to do what's best for them? That's the perfect way to put it. But by all means, this movie is a must watch and I would give it a B plus. It's a B plus movie. I'm definitely interested to see where the rest of the cast in this film goes career-wise because I think that they're really good and if they came out with a sequel with this one, I'd check it out by all means. <laughs> and the best thing I will say, they make fun of a lot of romantic comedy tropes that you see in a lot of films and it, and that was ah, great. Thank you. <laughs> but are you going to check out Fire Island? Comment below. Let me know. Are there some other good films that are good for Pride Month? Let me know. I'll check them out if I haven't seen them already. But by all means, my name is Travis. This is Candid at the Movies. Y'all have a good one.